Operation Orchid, download this disk image, find the flag. All right, so I've gone ahead and downloaded the disk image. It was a gzip file, I decompressed it. I now have this thing, so we're gonna use sleuth kit. Um, it's gonna tell me what partitions are on there. I'm going to guess that this last partition is probably the interesting one. 11648. So there's the top level folders. And let's just see if we can find anything that's a flag. Um, oh, I forgot the recursive. Yeah. All right, so we now have two things. We could ICAT. Six. Uh, that doesn't look like it has the flag in it anymore. Seventeen two. All right, so that looks like the flag. It looks like it's probably been encrypted with OpenSSL. Um, so let's try to figure out where that file lives. Um, let's just take this. And we now have a list of all the files. Okay, so this right next to it, that's sort of interesting. In the root folder, there's flag.txt, and this looks like a shell history. So we might, if we're lucky, find the command that was used to encrypt the file. So that's 1875. So there is the history, and here was the command that was used to encrypt the file. So it looks like AES. So we just need to figure out how to decrypt it. AES-256. And I'm going to pass in a dash D to decrypt. That'll probably make everything look great. So I'll grab this command. So I'll copy paste that. Add the dash D to decrypt. We want to have our input file be the encryption, our output file be the flag. Oh, we don't actually have the flag file yet because I didn't actually make it. All right, so we grab that file with this ICAT command. Want that to be the flag TXC encrypt. Now we'll decrypt. Oh, bad decrypt. That's unfortunate. Oh, but I guess it was good enough. All right, so there's our flag. Hunting past. 